Okay, the statistics calculator has several regions. It has an area for numbers from 1 to 10. It has an optional input for the precision measure of the instrument. And it has outputs for several statistics, namely the number of points, the maximum, the minimum, the median, the average deviation, the standard deviation, the standard deviation of the mean, the average, and the uncertainty in the average. It also has two buttons, one to perform the calculations and one to clear all the values, which is useful if you want to analyze a small set of data after a larger set so you don't need to clear each cell individually. So let's try an example. Put one, two, instead of putting the three here, let's put it over here to show that the numbers don't have to be in any particular order. Now when we press the calculate button, You'll notice it says that we can't determine the answer in the average because we haven't given the precision measure. But So we get the number of points is 3, the maximum is 3, the minimum is 1, the median is 2, the middle value, the average deviation, the standard deviation, the standard deviation of the mean, and the average of 2. Notice there's no uncertainty in the average because we didn't give a precision measure. If we now put in a value, like say 0.5, and recalculate. Now we get a value for the uncertainty in the average, which is the bigger of the standard deviation of the mean and the precision measure. If the precision measure were different, were bigger, say 0.6, then when we recalculate, we'll see that the uncertainty in the average is now the precision measure rather than the standard deviation of the mean. Kay. So we can clear the values and try again. Say we change the precision measure to 0.1 and now we make our numbers 1, 1.1 and 1.2. Now when we calculate the number of points is again 3, the maximum is 1.2, the minimum is 1, the median is 1.1, standard deviation, average deviation, standard deviation of the mean, precision measure, the average, and the uncertainty in the average. Now again, if we make the standard the precision measure smaller and we calculate, now we see that the uncertainty in the average has changed because it's the bigger of the standard deviation of the mean and the precision measure.